to start by saying I grew up in a particular way. I was lucky to grow up in segregated Birmingham, Alabama. Right? That might sound odd. But my parents had me believing that I couldn't have a hamburger if the wool were such counter, but hey, I could be anything I wanted, including President of the United States if I wanted to be, Secretary of State, whatever I wanted to be. Now, the way that they did that was kind of interesting because they had two important mantras, and I now repeat these to my students. One was, you have to be twice as good. Now, they meant this as armor against prejudice, but I tell my students, if you work hard enough to think you might be twice as, be twice as good, you're going to be confident, and nobody's going to be able to throw you off your, your horns. Secondly, they said, there are no victims. They said, because the minute you have described yourself as a victim, you have given control of your life to somebody else. You might not be able to control your circumstances, but you can control your response to your circumstances. Then they would say, now, uh, you, your armor is going to be you know, a high quality education. And, and, the, and then they also had several others, which really funny. So my father would say, somebody doesn't want to sit next to you because you're black. That doesn't matter, as long as they move. <laughs> saying is don't let somebody else's prejudice bring you down.